to be a bit more like consistent with uploading and every thursday i just want to share something that god has showed me god has spoken to me about and like that's literally just it and yeah since i have like a few minutes i don't want it to be very long and so when i was in, a, in the bathroom just taking a shower and i was just thinking because i was just been thinking strategy about my um like my instagram my my like just how because i deleted my instagram started on a new instagram yay and i was just thinking like mm, like how am i going to be able to just like build followers and all these things not even followers like i just want to be able to have impact on everything that i do and like good impact that's literally just what i want to do and so just trying to see how do i merge everything to come together like um my my relationship with god and maybe style and fashion like things that i like and also food yeah and so i was just thinking about it and i was in the in the, in the bathroom and like for the a couple of like past two days i've been uploading stuff on 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 tiktok and like i found it I, I like i've been watching videos like ladies who are just silent and they're just like doing you know like this this and this and then i did just one video like that and then uploaded it and it got followers like it 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 made some impact but i, I thought that it was very cute it looked so nice and i really liked it um and i was thinking maybe i should do a lot of that but then the thing is i remembered that um i cannot keep quiet like the mandate on my life um the person that god has called me to be keeping my mouth quiet allows the devil to be able to like to be able to move over me or to be able to just spew whatever he wants to be able to spew that my voice is very is very very um it's very it's very important it's very potent in this time and and i was thinking what like at this time i'm just keeping quiet so that i could get like a couple of followers but when i open my mouth my mouth just transcends trans like just moves in the realm of the spirit and my mouth and my voice is very powerful that it will be able to just bring people out into deliverance like that's just what just came into my mind and it's so funny like even in the morning um i was i was in like in like in 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 a certain ministry like we're just online we're just um sharing the word of god and all that and i was listening to the woman who's speaking apostle easy and and she was just saying i don't know that it's today morning or last night and she was just talking about the way that um you're supposed like names are given to you and people are very casual with names the names that they're being given and we're allowing an atmosphere to be created around you and for some reason and and just god brought me to a certain influencer and even a certain family and one of the influencers that just came to mind i was like oh my god because this influencer very popular in the in the u.s and i cannot name names but this popular influencer what happened is um she has been keeping quiet it's it's not bad to keep quiet you choose um there are moments even me don't just feel like talking to anyone but she has been keeping quiet but the thing is the problem is um so many things have been said about her so many things have been said about her so many words have left out of the mouths of people and 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 even a lot of men have just been labeling her a certain word because she's very young one and then she's seen to be dating a lot of men consistent a lot of men switching up men at the age at which she is and this is not a bash to her but i'm just saying like the revelation that god has given me and it has nothing to do with anyone but just what god was showing me and so yeah and so we're just thinking and, and it just came to me i was like having this moment oh wow like because she's kept silent because her mouth is shut because what her mouth not her ears because her mouth is shut people have created a perception around her one two people have labeled her a certain name it's 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 a derogatory name and i know some women and it's it's very unfortunate that women are celebrating this just saying oh yeah you can do whatever you want to do with your body let me tell you that body that you want to spread across the world world and let anyone use it i know you may not be, be believing in god but imagine how much more value it is if you yourself your own house you cannot let like anyone to come into your house and go however they feel like how about how much more your body can you imagine even like for plates we have plates that we keep for a certain time that they are special how much more your body 
how much more your body like if you think about it that way it actually makes like a kind of sense in a way and so i was just thinking about it and the holy spirit was just reminding me like oh wow there are names that have proceeded out of the, the mouths of people and they have called and labeled her a certain thing and for some reason i just kept thinking like in the next five years this this lady will be what she's been called if she does not take action to begin to denounce the names and begin to to, to speak over her life speak over the atmosphere that has been set over her life because these are accusations that are going before and as the names and, and it's very funny like even the apostle was saying that um the the the, the like men the men are co-creators like when, when god created adam and eve uh, when god created adam there's a time he gave him an assignment and the assignment that he gave him it was to name things there's an authority that men have when they name things sometimes that name god just concurs with it and says let it be when men name things and i'm saying it from an authority that men have when men name things because god allowed men to call like he's the one it was adam who was naming things it was not eve who was naming it was adam that was naming and so when men are naming a thing there's there's a power behind it there's an authority that men have and so i'm just thinking and for some reason i just got myself thinking and just saying oh my god i cannot believe this woman in the next five years the names that have proceeded, the atmosphere that has been surrounded along her name, she will be it. She will be that word that people have been calling her. And you're wondering why am why are people like why are why are people moving around or or why am I a certain way? And it is the names that people have called you. And I wanted to keep quiet. Because I thought it is very cute to be on social media and just you know, like this this videos you know, like just like very cute but i realized my voice it is it that is what god has given me that my voice is it and so i cannot afford to keep quiet i do not have that that mandate to keep quiet my mouth is very powerful my voice is very powerful i do not allow anyone to actually call me whatever i am not i will not allow that i will not allow for my voice to be shut even if I know I am not that thing, but because an atmosphere has been set, that thing will become me. And the second way that I was just thinking about it, it just came like, like the Holy Spirit. I just began to see, like, I was just thinking about that certain family. And that certain family has been accused of any man that comes to date them. Their life after them goes down. And for some reason, even they were called witches. And they, they did not take time to be able to just go forth and denounce what, what had been said over them. They allowed it. So it is very important that we are very, very, very careful with the names that are attached to us. You do not keep quiet. And, and I keep like, it, it's so funny that it's just that thing of a silent mouth is a silent destiny. And so for me, myself, and I, I pray that if you're watching this and if you watch this, that you're able to understand and know that a silent mouth is a silent destiny. So do not keep quiet. Do not allow people to attach certain names up to your name and do not be silent. Do not trade your like your voice for something else. I was just about to trade my voice for followers on, on TikTok and on Instagram. But I remembered what God had said about me. I remembered the words that he has spoken. I remembered he said, my mouth. He wants to use my mouth. He wants to use my voice. I know he wants to use the whole of my body, but my mouth. As I call it forth. As I speak, someone is delivered. As I talk, someone is delivered. And so, yeah. If you really liked this, you can subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. And also, I'd, I'd like to hear what you're thinking, what are your thoughts are, just in the comments. And share with your friends. Subscribe. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.